my name is Alan Hong, a Strategic Marketing Manager at Thoracic Technologies. With the latest designs requiring tens of gigabit per second transfer speeds and high density logic, integrated circuits have been constantly decreasing in size and power in order to meet the most demanding needs. With the latest nodes of FPGAs reaching 28 nanometers, Altera Stratix 5 FPGAs offer a combination of extreme high speed transceivers vast numbers of logic elements, and cost-competitive pricing. Today, I'm going to introduce Thoracic's own Stratix 5 hardware development environment, the DE5Net. The DE5Net FPGA development kit is perfectly suited for extreme high-speed needs, including cloud computing, high-frequency trading, and security networks. Featuring an ultra-high bandwidth memory architecture, low-latency networking interfaces, expandable memory, and much more, the DE5Net allows for maximum flexibility in terms of low power, speed, and performance. Let's look at the board in detail. First, let's introduce our FPGA, which is the Altera Stratix 5 GX, which features 622,000 logic elements. We also have two SODIM slots for DR3 with 204.8 gigabits per second of peak bandwidth we also have 32 megabytes of high bandwidth QDR2 plus memory with a peak bandwidth of 140.8 gigabits per second. For interfacing, we have our high speed Gen 3 by 8 PCI Express lanes. We also have four lanes of SFP plus ports, each transferring at 10 gigabits per second. Timing input. We also have our four SATA ports two host ports and two device ports, which are also Gen 3. And our standard interfaces such as switches, push buttons, SMA, hex displays. And for non-volatile storage, we also have 256 megabytes of memory for flash. And also included on the DE5Net is the onboard USB Blaster 2 for FPGA configuration. This demonstration showcases the different peripherals and interfaces on the DE5Net board. Over here we can see the DE5Net board plugged in to the PCIe slot of our PC. On the computer, we have a program that intermixes two different frames of a video signal on top of each other to create a 3D effect. This video signal is then sent through the PCIe to our FPGA, which in turn uses the DDR3 as a memory buffer, and then sends that signal over SFP Plus on a 10 gigabit per second signal through a 6 meter cord. Our other FPGA board features an extension for a daughter card that has an HDMI output. Over here on our HD monitor, you can see a 3D image showcasing a full 1080p resolution. If you were to put on these 3D glasses, you would be able to see a 3D effect. Overall, this demonstration showcases the different interfaces such as PCIe communication, HDMI output, high-speed SFP Plus interface, and DDR3 interface as well. As we can see, the DE5Net presents a formidable feature set of high bandwidth memory architecture with low latency interfaces perfect for meeting today's high demand needs. Thank you for watching the demonstration of the DE5Net. For all questions and support, please reach us at support at